Long time ago, someone gifted two baby eagles to a king. The breed of eagles was very good, and the king had never seen such magnificent eagles before. The king was very pleased with the gift and decided to hire an experienced caretaker for them. After some time, the king saw that both of them were quite big, and now they were looking more fantastic than earlier. The king said to the man taking care of the eagles, I want to see their flight. You signal them to fly in the sky. The man did the same. Both eagles started fluttering as soon as they saw the signal. But where one eagle was touching the heights of the sky, the other flew for some seconds and returned to the branch where it was earlier sitting, the same branch from where it had started flying. After seeing this, the king felt something strange. He became curious to know the reason for the contrasting behavior of eagles. The king asked the caretaker, what's the matter? Where one eagle is flying so well, the other one is not trying to fly. The caretaker replied, yes, this has been a problem from the beginning with this eagle, it does not leave this branch. Both the eagles were adorable to the king, and he desperately wanted to see the second eagle also flying high in the sky. Next day he announced throughout the state that the person who managed to make this eagle fly high would be rewarded with heavy prizes. After the announcement, many intellectuals and knowledgeable persons came and tried to apply the knowledge they had to make the eagle fly high. But no one was successful. Even after the passage of a couple of weeks, there was no improvement in the eagle. It used to fly a little bit and then return to its branch. The king too lost hope and almost gave up. Then one day something strange happened. The king saw that both of them were flying high in the sky. He could not believe his eyes and immediately called the caretaker. The caretaker informed the king, yes, the second eagle is also flying high in the sky. One man has been successful in making the second eagle fly high. The king asked the caretaker to bring the person who had accomplished this feat. The next day, he was brought before the king, who was eagerly waiting with the promised prize. The king came to know during interactions that the man was a simple farmer. After offering the gold currencies as his reward, the king said, I am very pleased with you, just tell me how did you do this, which the great scholars and highly qualified people could not do. The farmer said, Your Highness, I am a simple farmer, I don't have knowledge like scholars, I just simply cut down the branch on which the eagle had a habit of sitting. As there was no branch, it had no option but to fly, and it did that very well. You see, the eagles in this tale represent us humans. Each of us has incredible potential, just like those majestic birds. But sometimes, we're like that one eagle, stuck on our comfortable branch. The simple farmer who made the eagle fly high represents the power of change and stepping out of our comfort zones. He didn't possess scholarly knowledge or fancy tools, all he did was cut that branch. In our lives, the branch can symbolize our comfort zones, those safe and familiar places where we tend to stay. But true growth, like the eagle soaring high, often happens when we dare to venture beyond what's comfortable. So, the lesson here is pretty clear. If you want to reach new heights, you might need to cut some branches in your life. These branches could be old habits, self-doubt, or even fear. It's about taking that bold step, like the farmer, to remove what's holding you back. Just remember, when you let go of the branches that limit you, you open up the sky to endless possibilities. You can achieve great things, just like that eagle soaring majestically in the sky. It's a reminder that sometimes, the simplest actions can lead to the most incredible transformations.